the mayor and the commission challenged us to come up with something that would be more community-minded. Something that could lower the density and lower the intensity of the approved project. And something that could be a contribution to our community. A public park, the completion of the beach walk to the boardwalk so that we could have a continuous circumference of South Beach. The park itself, the city determined, has a value of over $80 million. Here they're getting it for free. That gives real value, real importance to this project. It was particularly great timing in the sense that the ULI and the Harvard research reports were being done as it relates to green solutions to the issue of sea level rise. Miami Beach really sits at the epicenter of the discussion regarding sea level rise. This project is really intended to show how resilient of a community Miami Beach can be. The park itself becomes that example. Landscape architecture is a green solution to resiliency. The park will include a flood protection basin, a native planting pallet, berms, green roofs, a system of elevated pathways, which is really going to be important for Miami Beach in the future. It will be the most resilient project ever built in a coastal community up and down the eastern and western seaboards. The park will have multiple access points, both on grade and elevated. This park will be accessible to the entire neighborhood. A pedestrian bridge doubles as the gateway entrance to Miami Beach, which previously did not exist. That includes South Point Park, Loomis Park, the beach itself, and the entire bay walk along the western coastline of Miami Beach. The park will include an internal loop of approximately one-third of a mile, which will connect all the different programming within the park itself. A children's playscape, a fitness area, a community gathering place, a dog park, an outdoor cafe, and neighborhood retail. Open lawn space, a flex space that'll double as parking for weekend markets, all incorporated into the resilient berms and bioswells throughout the park itself. There will be multiple community spaces set on top of the buildings themselves. We have green roofs, terraces set within them that will provide vistas towards Biscayne Bay and the rest of Miami Beach. It took years to assemble such a large and significant site in South Beach. While we originally got involved to save a hospital, we realized quickly that this assemblage of land will never be duplicated on Miami Beach again. Our family is multi-generational on Miami Beach and understands that it's not what we build for ourselves today, but what we build for the generations to come.